class for week three, our focus is going to be on project three, which is your first essay, Narrating an Encounter. So this essay is going to be the culmination of everything you've learned in your toolbox so far in this class. So remember in the first week we added commas and capital letters, and then last week we spent a whole lot of time talking about the writing process and introductions and conclusions. Well, now you're being shown kind of the main body of the paragraph. So this week to your toolbox, you're adding what we call thesis statements, which are statements that tell the reader what the whole paper will be about. And then you have what are called body paragraphs. These come in between the introduction paragraph and the conclusion paragraph. And in academic writing, we usually have three body paragraphs. And within body paragraphs, you have things called topic sentences, which are sentences that tell the reader what the whole paragraph will be about. And then you have support. So the support um, kind of illustrates what the topic sentence of the paragraph is saying. And you'll read more about that in uh, our textbook for the week. Now, you may also remember that from last week, you read about something called the writing process. That's where you have pre-writing, maybe you do an outline, you do some drafting and revising. Uh, we're going to now apply that to writing your first paper. And to help walk you through that writing process with the paper, I've made another video, um, which you can view in this message down below. And I'll also send out that video in a follow-up announcement, um, news announcement, later on in the week. Okay, But that video will walk you through the first few steps of the writing process and really the whole thing to help you with that. Now, to continue on the theme of narration and narrative, in the discussion form this week, you're going to do something a little different. You're going to go into the ORU library database and look for an example of a narration. So a, narr a narrative is just another word for a story, essentially. So I've also made a little short two-minute video to help you know how to go into the ORU library database to find what you need for the discussion form. So again, there's another video in this message right down below uh, that you can click and watch and I'll send out a reminder of it later in the week too. Um, but that's really all you need to know for this week. Just keep those two important videos um, in mind that are coming up. How to do the writing process for Project 3 and how to use the ORU library for the discussion forum. Alright, I look forward to seeing you uh, throughout the rest of this week.